Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tiffany. Welcome. So in today's video, we're going to be doing four hairstyles just for prom. Let me show you guys my dress. Like it's so cute. It's like white and it has all these like little like sparkly tassels on it. Anyway, so today's video, I'm going to share with you guys four hairstyles that you can wear for prom. Now, I know what prom we have to go all out. We have to do curls. We have to do everything. So I did a mixture in this video of natural hairstyles and hairstyles with like extensions, wigs, all of that, just for all type of people. And they're really super simple and easy. Now, if you're someone who's not going to be doing your own hair, which for prom, I wouldn't be doing my own hair. I'd probably get someone else, but we need hair inspo. Like what type of hairstyle can I do? So this video is perfect for you guys. If you guys are interested, make sure you guys stay tuned and let's begin with this video. Okay, so we're just gonna get into the first hairstyle here. So I already started with curling the bottom half of my hair. So we're gonna have this part up. It's gonna be a half up, half done. Um, I'm going to spray it, hairspray it. You guys, if you're doing this hairstyle yourself, or someone's doing it for you, just ensure they put hairspray. Because if there's no hairspray, the curls are gonna draw, and they're gonna look like waves, and they're just not gonna look as good. Anyway, so I'm just gonna go with mousse for the top of my hair. I've had this styled in a side part for the longest time, so the mousse is just gonna soften soften up the texture oh also for this hairstyle you're going to want to go in with a hot comb to ensure that like the top of your hair is as flat as possible so it looks like scalp again okay. okay so we're just going to add a middle part so what you want to do is go in either by doing a triangle or a square so this is going to be the first one and then all you're going to want to do is get a, a rubber band now it's the small like the really small ones here and you, you can do this how big or small now what i would recommend is you guys go in with colored rubber bands so if your dress is pink go in with like pink hair rubber bands that looks so good i think i should have done this way more at the front we'll do one more we'll just do two so what you're gonna want to do is go in with another square again go with the second rubber band now the difference with the the one behind is that you're gonna join this one with this one here then i should have had colored rubber bands so you guys can see how nice it would look instead of using like boring black it should look like that and now, I'm going to add some mousse just to fold it in. And then, we're going to do the same thing on this side here. Part the hair. And it's something a little bit different instead of just doing like a half up, half down. Because I know a lot of people for prom, they do half ups, half downs, which are like so nice. But why, why not make it a little bit different by adding, adding some character to it? We're going to put up our hair now. We're going to do the half up, half down. Just want to prep it. You can make it as tight or as high as you want it to. Tighten it so it looks like that. But then we're going to get a piece, small piece, and we're going to wrap it around the hairband so we can hide it. This part is optional, but a lot of people like this. I just keep on wrapping till it gets shorter and shorter and shorter. And then I just tuck it in. So you just want to brush out the ends. Okay, so what we're going to go in now with curling our hair. So you guys can definitely leave out some pieces of hair at the front. Just to have more curls. I think everyone likes curls for prom because I do. This is the longest baby hair in my life that I've seen. Okay, so what we're going to do now is curl the top. I'm so excited. Take fly rays at least. Okay, so this is the end look of this hairstyle. Basically, it's a half up, half down. The only difference is, beyond like adding curls, we added some character with the rubber band. Now, again, as I said, if I had white rubber bands, I would literally put white as the rubber band. So if you're wearing like a pink dress, a purple dress, a blue dress, add the same color that you're wearing for your dress in the rubber band, and it looks so good. So that's it. Let's go on to the next hairstyle. Okay, so this hairstyle here is super simple, but it's revolutionary. You guys need to do this hairstyle. Your hair is going to be the statement piece for your prom dress, okay? So if you're someone who's doing like very simple dress, actually, no, do this even if you have a very like elegant, you're just going to stand out all night. How our hair actually looks under wigs. Anyways, so it's time for us to take out all of this. So what you're going to want to do is take out all your braids or your plaits, whatever you have in your head. And then I'm going to go in with putting hair oil in my hair. You guys need to do that. So everyone that we pull out, you're just gonna add in a little bit more hair oil. With this hairstyle, you want your hair to look hydrated. You guys wanna make sure it's combed out good. Duh. Good. Duh. Okay, so we're almost done here. So we're gonna comb this out too. I'm gonna add a middle part. Okay, so I'm going back in with more hair oil. Very lightly, I'm just passing it throughout the hair because again, you want your hair to look hydrated and moisturized. 
I'm going to take out my stud earrings and we're going to go in with earrings. Now the silver matches with like the little tassels here. I'm just going to go in with baby hair since it's prom guys. You can go all out and do baby hairs. Usually I don't but it's prom. This is it for this hairstyle. So basically it's just an afro. And then we added some statement earrings. So they're just basically big hoop earrings. Now I have a whole entire haul on my channel testing out like beauty supply store makeup and trying them on. And I literally got these out of beauty supply store for like $3. And they came in a set of three so you guys can definitely get them there they come in like gold silver you guys have to do this hairstyle such a statement piece so easy and simple why not show off your natural hair trust me your photos are going to look so good you're just going to look so good in general now these are for my natural hair growth who are unapologetic like i would be wearing this this would be my number one pick let me know down below what you guys think if you guys are liking this video so far give it a thumbs up comment down below what you guys think okay and yeah, let's move on to the next hairstyle. Okay, so now this hairstyle I would actually do from when I'm in the shower, like wet my hair from in the shower, but I have makeup on. And I can't get that wet. So I'm going with my spray bottle here. And I'm gonna just wet my hair. Now, you don't have to do this hair with dry head hair. Dry head hair? Dry hair? Yeah, I was gonna say dry head. With dry hair, I think it'll look better. So I'm just gonna try and wet it as much as I can. And I'm only focusing the wetness around like the perimeters. But again, I'll do this in the shower because I would want my hair fully, 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 fully wet. Because it's just easier to do this hairstyle. So what I'm going to do is brush back everything. And I still have these hoop earrings in because these hoop earrings are going to be like statement pieces. Or you can do like long dangly ones, whatever that will look best. What I'm going to do, I'm not. this is not going to be like um, my finish hairstyle. I just need to get this wet a little bit more. So doing this is gonna help me um, brush up my hair much better and to help me see like how my progress is and if I need to add more water. I'm gonna brush my hair completely back. Even the baby hairs for now. I take out the bun and I'm gonna redo it. We're gonna make the bun like really high. Now the reason why I feel like it looks better with my hair sleek, my hair wet, it just makes the hairstyle look a little bit more sleek. Okay, I think this high is fine. <laughs> So as you guys can see, my hair kind of looks slick, sleek and slick without hair gel or yeah, hair wax. So I'm just going to put hairspray instead. So hairspray can tame the flyaways. You may have to go in with gel though, but in my case, I don't have to. So what you want to do is section off your hair in two. You want to make sure that your hair is fully detangled. And then you're going to want to, I may have to make this much smaller because my hair is thick. So you're going to want to twist this. And also, if you feel as if your natural hair is not long enough to do this, what you can do is use some of the, like, the cancalon, like the braiding hair to do braid, and it will work. So you want to wrap it all the way around. The same thing for this one. I'm trying to wet the hair so it can still look a little bit, like, sweet. I might put a little bit of gel. So I'm using the main choice ancient Egyptian twisting gel. I really use this, but this smells so good. So good. And I'm just going to... Even though this hairstyle may, may be a typical hairstyle, I just feel like it always gives like a sleek look. Like it always looks good. Once you're like really well put together and you have your makeup nice. I'm trying to make this bun <laughs> as tall as I can. If you have bobby pins, this would be really good because you can make your bun even taller and just add the bobby pins in. But as you can see, I didn't wrap the top part all the way around, even down to the bottom. I did. I just wrapped it around the top and stuck it in. Of course, we're going to go in with baby hair this time. So we're going to be using the Soft Touch Hair Wax in the Style Stick. And again, I recommend this hair wax to anyone who has like hair in the 4s, like 4A, 4C, 4B. Like this will hold down your hair. And I'm not over-exaggerating. You can't find this nowhere but in Jamaica. I'm just joking. If I can find them online, I'm going to link them so you guys can buy because this is the gel. This gel is it. So basically this one is with your natural hair, it's a top knot bun. Like as I said throughout the tutorial that I like this one because you can get away going to prom with such a sleek, nice, but very simple hairstyle. All you have to do is the things that I showed you guys and again like have your makeup looking really nice, you have a nice really pretty dress on and you're going to look good. You're going to part your hair in two. Okay, I'm just going to put the top in a quick little holding bun and we're going to just comb up the back. Okay, guess what? I was basically doing my hair and then I noticed that my memory card was full so it literally cut off. So 
so many things that I said. So I basically left off saying that you need to part your hair horizontal across your head. You can also achieve this hairstyle with a half wig. And I did a whole entire hair tutorial video on four hairstyles you can do with half wigs for prom. So I'm going to link that video so you guys can watch because... I literally only have like 20 views on it. I don't understand why. <laughs> because I was saying that basically like it would look, this hairstyle would look nice if you have really curly hair. I don't know if it might look a little bit childish, but it would look good. But the thing is, for me to get my curls out, I would have to like drench my hair, basically wash my hair, and I'm not going to do that. So I'm going to do an afro. I'm textured for this hairstyle. What I did also was that I parted my hair, and then I sectioned off the front on this side, and you just want to do the same for the other side as well. We're gonna wet this part as much as we can. Actually, we're just gonna dap it, and we're going to leave out some pieces, so I feel like this piece can be left out, this small little piece can be left out. You're gonna do a bun and then leave out some pieces. You're going to want to go in with your gel, and you're going to put the gel on the pieces that you left out of the bun to define the curl texture, and then you're going to do the same thing on the next side as well. What we're going to do, my baby hair, redefine. Words have been so loud lately. Like they've been really loud. Like this is the fir like, first time in a long time. The Blackbirds. I don't know what their correct name is. Do you hear them? They're talking to each other. Okay, so this is it for this hairstyle. So as you can see, the birds are talking so much. It's like really big at the back, has two little, and then some curls. Now I feel like this hairstyle, oh my god. I bet this hairstyle will look really good if it's just like full curls at the back. But it's fun still with Hair texture and it'll still make you look innocent. Okay, so I want you guys to comment down below what your favorite hairstyle was. Okay? And give this video a thumbs up and like it if you found it useful. Subscribe to my channel because I do a lot more hair tutorials on my channel here. Have fun at prom and I'll see you guys in my next video. Au revoir.